Hey guys, it's Busy B coming at you on V-Day. My A-Day and my V-Day. Happy anniversary to me and my husband and happy Valentine's to all of you out there. First, I wanna say thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel and viewing my videos. I am really surprised that I have almost 100 people that are actually watching and care about what I say, but it's, it's fun, it's great, this community is awesome. I love that we support ourselves. I love that people are out there trying to get the best deal possible for their family. So for that, I wanna say thank you very much. Um, I had a great day at CVS. I got a deal that I haven't really seen anybody else do or talk about, and maybe it's because it's not a money-making deal or we're not getting any ECBs back, but sometimes you gotta buy stuff and sometimes you have to pay out of pocket for things and it's because you need them, because your family needs them, and you know, it's not always about just skin care, hair care, deodorant, deo for your BO, and shaving cream, and razors, and toothpaste, and brushes, and whatever we got going on at the drugstores that we love to shop at. Sometimes it's about buying the necessities for your family. It just depends on how you work the deals. Well, I was at CVS yesterday, and I discovered um, when I was there doing my hair care stuff that Cheerios were on sale. Buy one, get one free. All different flavors. Tons of different flavors, the chocolate, the multi-green, the honey nut Cheerios, the banana nut, the cinnamon nut, all different kinds of Cheerios were on sale. And um, the price that they were ringing up was at $4.19 per box. Um, and again, it's buy one, get one free, so it's basically paying like $2.10 for a box of cereal, which, okay, it's a deal, you need it, okay, but if you have a coupon, it makes the deal even sweeter. The coupon that I had, and I forgot to bring it out here because I have some extra left, was a dollar off of two boxes. So essentially it made the Cheerios, a box of Cheerios, like a dollar sixty. And that's a great deal. So I bought 20. I used some of my expired coupons. I actually was rung out by a store manager because it was so crazy busy. Oh, by the way, don't ever just try and go major shopping on Valentine's Day at CVS because there's some really wacky people out there that forgot to shop ahead of time for Valentine's Day and are shopping on Valentine's Day for Valentine's Day. I, I'm a strange breed, but I like to plan ahead. Anyway, so I did. I got banana nut, and this was the 10.9 10, uh, 10 ounce box. I got the cinnamon burst, and again, 10.9 ounce, or yeah, somewhere around there. But the one that I really stocked up the most on was the Honey Nut Cheers, because these, these are 12 ounces, 12.25 ounces. So I got 20 boxes of cereal, which I have three hollow legs in my family, and this will last me maybe two weeks at most because they eat it for a snack, they eat it at night, they eat it in the morning before school, they go through cereal. Um, I probably would have gotten all 20 boxes Honey Nut Cheerio if I didn't know my family as well as I do, and they need a little variety, so I did go down to the 10-ounce boxes so that they could flip it out, you know, Honey Nut Cheerio one day, Banana Nut another day, anything. So... That was a great deal. Again, I ended up buying 20 boxes of Cheerios and I spent $26. And again, I needed it. I knew I was going to pay out of pocket for it. It's like going to the grocery store. You don't get everything for free. It's not like that show extreme couponing. You have to pay money sometimes. Um, but I thought it was a great deal. Um, the other thing is, is that these coupons, the WIS coupons, coupon.com, they're printing out... <clears throat> Save $2 on one bottle of 100 ounce or larger. I have a feeling these are going to come in handy soon. So go grab you some of these because I, I know. Coupons.com. Um, the other thing is, is that on my hunt for that ridiculous flyer that I have not been able to find because none of my CVSs, and I go to five different CVSs in my area, no one has any idea what the heck I'm talking about. With that Heart Smart pamphlet, that white pamphlet with a big red heart on it, and you would think anybody, anybody in this world that deserves that thing right now would be me. But anyway, I can't find it. I've asked pharmacies. I've asked customer service up front. I've asked managers. No one understands it. And I live right on the border between two states. So I go to two different states. Okay, I went to two states. I still can't find this sucker. But what happened today was when I asked the pharmacy pharmacist today, I said, okay, I'm looking for this. He reaches under the counter and pulls out this huge bin, plops it on the counter, starts digging through it. And I'm like, what's he got in there? Freaking coupons! You know, the peelies, little things, the sticky stuff, the pads that people put. Freaking chocked full of it. Not only that, plain old, unstapled 
just fly by the seat of their pants on their own, reinventing beauty coupons. No magazine attached. Some of these coupons were expired, and I'm not talking like past 30 days. I'm talking about like last summer expired. And I, I kind of like looked at them and I was like, uh, is there a reason why you don't put these coupons out? Like, is there something going on I don't know about? And he goes, ah, we just don't get to it. We just don't have time. We get really busy. And sometimes we just forget. And so we just throw them all in here. And if somebody's looking for a coupon, you know, this is where we kind of go and we pull these out. I'm going, are you, are you kidding me? You mean all the videos that I've seen, all my other couponers that have made that have been like, I found this coupon at CVS. You guys have stocked in a bin underneath the counter? That's what I'm thinking. Of course, that's not what I said. Instead, I politely looked at him and said, oh my gosh, that's so amazing. Do you mind if I like look through this? Um, maybe there's a coupon that I missed that I would love to have. He goes, here, I'm kind of busy. Why don't you take it over there to that seating area and dig through it and take out whatever you want? I, I was like, oh, 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 okay, grab the bin walk out. A lot of them were expired, but I did get these. I didn't take all of them, but I did take most of them. I think I left two. Just in case somebody else stumbles upon this. I don't want to be a shelf clear. Be accused of that kind of stuff. And then I found these. They don't expire until June. Oh, all right. There we go. See? Yeah. Dollar off L'Oreal. Any product, anything expires June of this year. I didn't take the whole pad. I just ripped off a bunch and left some in there again. Didn't take them all. And then the other thing I saw that was kind of sitting off to the side was this thing. I don't know. Again, I'm, I'm still fairly new to this coupon thing. I don't really know if we ever talk about this. I don't know who's talked about this. But these are the diabetes packets that CVS gives out. And inside of this, it, I mean, it's a great tool. I mean, if you know anybody that has diabetes, if you are diabetic yourself, I mean, there's a log book. It's it's sponsored by One Touch, go figure, um, the Delica One Touch um, people that are constantly trying to get us to buy their stuff. But it's got all, it's got a food guide. It explains to you about carbohydrates. It's really kind of cool. I looked through it. But what was awesome inside were all these high value coupons. Hello? Uh, $3 off any purchase, two of Johnson & Johnson's first aid products. $1.50 off a of Neosporin. Uh, $2 off of Cordaid. A dollar off of Listerine. These don't expire until December of this year. Okay? December. There's a whole year's worth of coupons I got. Got Monistat. I got Splenda. 50 cents off of one Splenda. I've got Neosporin again. Any one. Excludes trial size. Lip health. Ooh. <laughs> they ain't seen nothing yet. You know me and my lip stuff. Oh, and this is something I really wanted to get today and I forgot. $2 off of any one Visine products. Eye drops. Dollar off of Lubriderm. Excludes trial size. You know those little mini ones? Yeah, those are trial. You know the next size up? Those aren't trial. Dollar off. Lubriderm. Two dollars off of Bengay. Three dollars off the One Touch Delica Lancet. So those are the refills for those little machines that we have been getting for free. And really, I valuable, it's valuable coupons inside. See that valuable coupons inside right there? So if you guys don't know about that, maybe you do, maybe you don't. It was new to me. I thought I'd share it. Um, so that's basically what's going on today. Oh, I did have a, a message posted to me about what does that Palmer's coupon look like? Because I guess a lot of people are getting different ones that say different things. This is the one that I have saved to my desktop. Okay, so this is what it looks like right here. No expiration date. Manufacturer's coupon. It says, save $2 on any Palmer's cocoa butter formula with vitamin E facial product. Now, the lip balm is not listed here, but I'll read this to you. It says, limit one coupon per purchase on product specified, which, of course, we know it means only one per item. Um, coupon um, offer not valid on trial sizes or Palmer's cocoa butter formula swabble stick. That's that stick I keep telling you about. That's by the lotion. Can't use it on that. Void, reproduce, you are authorized to act as our agent to redeem this coupon. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Oh, you know what's really cool about this? It doesn't, there's no limit. So if I found 10, I don't have to break my transaction up. I can buy 10 and use 10 of these coupons. I didn't realize that because I've been breaking my transactions off. See, it pays to read your coupon. Read your coupons. So anyway, that's what's going on with me today. Um, another update is that I have not called in regards, uh, I haven't called Target in regards to that email that I received. I am starting to hear people have received this, what they're calling a generic 
um, email saying if you have a problem, call us when they give you a code and whatever. Um, I haven't heard anybody post a video in regards to an actual phone conversation they had with that email. So I'm going to do it tomorrow. I'm Valentine's Day and my anniversary. I don't want to deal with that stuff today. I just want all things to be light, love, and happiness. So I'm going to try and do it tomorrow. Um, I have three very, very busy days, and then I have four days off. So if I don't get to it immediately, I promise I will follow up on it and let you guys know what happened. I think it's worth the effort. I mean, we made an effort, and this is their effort back to us. Let's see what happens. So hope you guys are having a phenomenal Valentine's Day. I'm getting ready to go out and um, spend some time with my family and just, again, laugh. We always do. is kind of a tradition for us. We kind of sit around, have dinner together, um, and talk about, like, what it's been like to be a family and uh, some of our great family moments. And then we always tell the story about how daddy and mommy met and how our wedding went. And so anyway, we're going to have a great night. And I hope you guys get some time to celebrate with the people that you love. I know a lot of people think this is just a commercial day, but I try and take it one step forward and just really kind of make the effort to talk about love and what it means to love people and what it means to love life and what it means to love just the world in general. And I hope that everyone gets an opportunity to feel love back in response. If not, I'm sending you love. So get you some love from me. Get you some love from the people around you and your family. Go get you some of that diabetes things if you don't have it. Go ask your pharmacist if they got a little bin behind the counter full of coupons. And, well, we'll see what goes on in the next coming few days. So, anyway, happy Valentine's Day. Thanks again, everyone, for watching. And I'll talk to you real soon.